hello welcome back to Sarah Reacts. Today we're going to be watching season 2 episode 10 of Ted Lasso and this one's called No Weddings and a Funeral. So yeah last episode was our beard centric episode. It's a very weird episode that had weirdly a lot of British TV advert references and I missed that fucking Van Der Boom one that Thierry Henry did for uh, the car, car one. <laughs> I love wacky episodes like that. Ones that make no sense as you're watching it but then on a second and third watch which I normally do with by the time I've edited it for YouTube <laughs> you're just thinking that was <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> I still don't know much more about Beard's past but it showed a lot more of who he actually is as a character which I appreciate. Unfortunately his day just kept getting worse and worse and eventually he did reconnect with Jane but I don't know the way they've framed her throughout the whole like two seasons hasn't been good yet the last episode kind of framed her as this great big love of his and it just it made no sense but it's fine but yeah enough chattering and um, let's get into it shall we? <sighs> Issue of Sam. Ooh, meow, meow. You're not being me. Go away George. Me out for me. The last time I spent this long in bed was because I strained a hamstring. <laughs> and grey. Oh, I have not seen one grey hair anywhere. It's not on my hand. Hmm. It's not down there. It's on my armpits. See? Ah. Oh, so. <laughs> Where are we going? About grey. Oh. oh my. <laughs> Right, okay, let's get the peasantries out of the way. He died. Aww. Do they know? So where do you think our father is right now? They know. The drawer of a few. Question right? answered. <laughs> what? I mean, like... I like to imagine a heaven where animals are in charge and humans are the pets. <laughs> I like to spend eternity curled up in front of a fire at Cindy Crawford's feet. Yeah. I'd like to be reincarnated as a tiger and then ravage anyone who looked at me wrong. <laughs> Shirts. <laughs> no trainers. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Well, what if they're like really nice Yeezys? Yeah. <laughs> Just shoes. What colour? <laughs> Bright red. Look at his face. Okay. I'll wear some dress shoes. <gasps> I love Rick Astley. You know, the old Rebecca used to love that song. Yeah, well, the whole world used to love that song. Then we heard it ad nauseum, and now we're over it. Well, I don't I'll never be over it. Once I love something, <laughs> I love it forever. Oh! Oh! Sassy and Ted, sit 
strangers to love. You know the rules. <laughs> She'd say you were Kathleen. It's up to mine. Never gonna give you love. Never gonna give you love. Probably a Rick Astley song to make me cry. Never gonna run around. Never gonna make you cry. Well, hey, Georgie. Never gonna say. Never gonna say goodbye. <laughs> Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let, let you down. down. Never gonna run around. Gonna give me. Fucking that died. 
I spent every single night for a whole year praying I could just talk to him just once or see him just one more time like this. But you crickled to it out, shit, And I got fuck all. Mm. But it didn't make me realise. We only got this one knife. I love you, Katie. I'm sorry. People will have just told us she loved they love her. <laughs> That's something I should warn you of. I won't even think it's more wonderful. <laughs> Season 2, episode 10 of Ted Lasso. Yeah, I didn't think I'd get emotional over a Rick Astley song, but here we are. <laughs> oh, that was a sweet episode. I wish we would have known more about her dad, but I suppose not knowing about him, you're able to kind of put your own perspective or thoughts, etc., on the dad. <laughs> let your mind wander. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm getting what I wanted. We're getting more in depth with his emotions and the therapy and stuff like that. It's been what I've been wanting this whole season ever since we got introduced to Dr. Sharon. So it's just oh, it's so good. I love hearing more about people's backstories and the reason they are who they are. Because like Ted said, your parents are your blueprints. So the fact that we're knowing more about everyone's fathers is revealing, shall we say. <laughs> And as usual, it's always fun to see Sassy and Nora. They are hilarious. <laughs> yeah, so full-length and daily access available at patreon.com forward slash And I'll see you next time.